Today I'm going to review the Chapin International 78005 low profile 12 quart oil drain container. So let's pull it out of the box and take a look at it. One of the things that attracted me to it is it has a large capacity. It's got a 12 quart capacity for oil, which is great. I like the fact that it's made in the USA. It really feels to be very high quality. Uh, certainly has a large target area for uh, draining your oil and what have you. Um, it's got a lot of different features. Let's take a look at them. So it's got two plugs. You can see they've got O-rings on them. Obviously one of them goes right in the center here for plugging it once your oil's in there. I'm left-handing it. <laughs> so the fact that it's got that rubber O-ring, I like that because I'm not going to have to worry about it leaking. Then down here on the bottom you can see that it has a drain plug for it. And this one goes in. It's not a drain plug, it's just a vent. This one's a vent. There's a place that you can knock the drain plug out, but I don't see myself doing that because so long as it has a vent, you'll be able to pour that out that end. So the vent is key here. Again, that thing goes right in, and with that rubber O-ring on there, that's gonna make a nice uh, solid connection very solid uh, I mean this thing is really stout you can see that it's got the built-in handles for carrying it I like that for sure and it sits up pretty good on its own it's 23 inches or 23 and a quarter inches tall and it's about 14 and three quarters inches wide and then the depth of it, when you lay it flat here, I'm measuring that at right around four and a half inches tall. Depending on how it's sitting. But it goes right underneath my motorcycle. Take a look at that right now. You can see that it slides right underneath this Harley Davidson with no problem at all. It's up on the center stand, so for doing an oil change or whatever, no problem. That low profile does a great job of getting right underneath that bike. Just a couple of other features to look at. I like the fact that it's got a handle on the bottom as well as the top. And I like the fact that it's got an area here for sticking your oil filter. So when you turn that upside down, let your oil filter drain out, obviously it'll drain down in here. And it's got a really good slope to it here. See if you can see that. And so it's got a significant slope to it. So all your oil is going to end up down in the, uh, the hole that it's supposed to go into. And... It's got uh, just a couple of holes, that way you're not gonna drop something down in there. I like the fact that it sets up on its own too, so if you wanna store this in the corner of your garage or whatever until you dump it or take it to a recycle center, uh, you don't have to worry about the thing won't sit up on its own. You know, some of these things, when they're plastic molded like that, the bottoms don't exactly lend itself to being, you know, standing up on its own. So this one has no problem doing that. All in all, I'd say quality built product. I would absolutely buy it again. Hope this helps.